Hello everyone, it's Exo Man, and I'm out here on the front of my property. And here you see a nice pear tree and a patch of bamboo that you might be familiar with from our videos. I think I know there's a a thresher, a bird called the thresher, nesting in here. I just heard it. There was one last year too. Anyway. Nice beautiful patch of bamboo for those of you who love bamboo. Only the problem is my house is over yonder, way back there, doing a lot of work on it right now. And my drain field is here. And I have a first and second tank by the house, the, the uh, septic tank and then the gray water and then out here I have a third tank before the drain field and don't ask me how all this bamboo got going here but I've got to tear it all out now because look at this I just tried to excavate this to get at it with the with the tractor with that little grater and of course that didn't do anything it just it just glided over the top of the mat the root mat so I have come out here and with a pickaxe and the shovel excavated and gotten the, to the chamber of my nightmares. Yes, that's right. Last night I, I had a nightmare. Well, I had troubled thoughts and dreams about this bamboo and about it destroying my septic field. So hopefully better late than never. I'm going, well, of course, there have been a lot of root growing into the seam of this all the way around you know trying to get to the candy the roots want to get to the candy even that gray water so delicious and nutritious for these bamboo roots but anyhow I am going to put uh, uh, what do you call it? copper sulfate in here and copper sulfate really inhibits attacks the roots you know it, 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 it creates a boundary the roots are discouraged and don't uh, and don't come after this stuff I am is my understanding once you saturate it the tank with it and I suppose the ground soil around this around this uh, chamber um, so anyway we're gonna flush some copper sulfate down into the lines out there in the septic field and hope in hopes that if the bamboo roots are uh, you know getting access to that intruding on that drain field that will stop it at least and I haven't had any problems as yet you know keeping my fingers crossed but I'm anticipating them if I don't deal with this so there you go bamboo and boy I'm sure I'm gonna hear a lot of comments there are a lot of people that hate bamboo I personally love it but I don't like it here so anyway please uh, share your comments about septic woes and about treatments about cures we always flush septic treatment down our toilet I wouldn't think it would be a good idea to flush copper sulfate in the toilet because that would get in the primary tank and that would be probably bad for the uh, bacteria you don't want to kill off the, the bacteria that breaks down <coughs> the sewage all right so anyway, thanks for watching, wish me luck, and uh, I shall return. All right, let's lift that hatch. have actually really gotten some penetration there through the seal you see uh, I created a thin root mat and then once the roots got access they increased in size and mass so hopefully the tank is still intact and you know I've heard that uh, bamboo I've read that it can actually 
break apart this concrete like it's nothing. So, I, I, it looks like I might run out. So, looks like it's way, way too full of water, but I don't, I don't know. There's no pump out here, it just kind of leaches out into that field right there. So we'll get this cleaned up and get some copper sulfate in there. Don't let it splash try, Yeah, try not to. Yeah, I'm going to get it better. Good thing it has some buoyancy. Actually, I think it'll hold. So you have to you have to get it with the back end. Yeah. Of <clears throat> I was thinking with all that flat part, it would have more surface area to lay on. Come Don't on. fall in, son. <laughs> That's gonna splash. Yeah, it is. You got that. No, you don't. I gotta get away. <laughs> <laughs> the walker and I are trying to get the stuff from around the lip. As you can see, quite a thick layer. You, so sir, are the poop master. <laughs> That's a cool nickname. <laughs> Poop Maestro Walker. I need to wash my boots off now. This is kind of a shitty thing you're doing here. <laughs> so the tractor actually came in handy at the end. <coughs> <laughs> Let's go wash up. <laughs>